An amusement ride in Florida is coming down after a St. Louis County teen fell to his death. Tyree Sampson died at Icon Park in Orlando back in April. Our Justina Cornell joins us in studio with reaction from the family and the ride operators. Justina. Yeah, Mike, so it's been almost seven months since this tragedy happened, and his family says it's long overdue. Today I spoke to mom's attorney, Michael Haggard, and he says with the amount of pain that Kia Dodd is facing, there's no happiness in the situation, but she does feel a bit of closure. Earlier today, the Orlando Slingshot shared this quote saying, we are devastated by Tyree's death. We have listened to the wishes of Tyree's family and the community and have made the decision to take down the ride, end quote. Plus, they say they will honor Tyree Sampson and his legacy in the classroom and on the football field by creating a scholarship in his name. Haggard tells me it's about time since the ride's takedown was the number one priority for the family. They believe he should have never been allowed on. Now, we've learned Tyree was too heavy for the ride and slipped out of his seat halfway down. Haggard says a lawsuit is still on the table and adds... More is to come. We're discovering documents every day about who was involved, how those seats were changed, who was there. Uh, so we've learned a lot and we're hoping to try the case next year and hopefully result in a lot of legislation federally that will make these rides safe. Now, I did ask when this ride would come down, and a spokesperson couldn't provide the exact time and says the timeline for taking the ride down will be determined by the approvals of all involved parties and regulatory entitles.